Now, Valentine's Day is just around the corner, and as dopamine levels in couples are kicking in, dopamine, a neurotransmitter associated with feelings of love, experts say too much of it could turn out to be a sign of a bad match. Hence, in the world full of happiness, an extra dose of dopamine can turn out to be a major red flag. In what they call it a dopamine land is an experience based in London which offers its visitors a multi-sensory event where they can take part in an interactive world of love and joy. Inside this mirrored room with endless reflections and hanging lights illuminating with colour, visitors are visually transported in a scenario that makes them happy. And uh, the one kind of experience is scheduled until the 30th of April this year. Now being a one-of-a-kind experience in this room, the ground is your enemy and visitors can create their musical tunes and have a good relaxing time jumping on interactive squares in a mirrored maze. When you are having a good time, the human brain tends to release an increased amount of dopamine and a dating and relationship coach explains how dopamine can also be a warning sign when dating. The dating and relationship coach explains that dopamine is a natural high when a person feels a rush of euphoria and a feeling of excitement, happy and as if they are on a cloud nine. Now, however, dopamine can also be a warning sign when dating. Experts explain an intense rush of dopamine could signify a trauma bond. That is when two people experience an intense chemical high when they connect with each other because of shared difficulties or past trauma. The experts also warn that too much dopamine could cloud our judgment of a potential partner, skewing our ability to see the real person. Experts conducted one such study and found regions of the brain rich in dopamine became active when showing a photo of someone special to them. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.